this video I will be building a radial wheel the first thing I do is just mark off my reference point with a piece of masking tape the spokes I will be using are Sapem Race 264 so for the first step you need a hub and as you can see I marked off one of the holes this is because I always like that my hub is parallel to the ground when when my bike is standing but you can just use any hole from the reference point for the first spoke I will skip one hole and insert the spoke into the second hole that's just because I want my hub to sit at a certain position I don't screw the, the nipples on all the way because it becomes really difficult to add the last spokes so I just leave a little bit of thread once I have the first spoke attached to the rim I then just add the rest of the spokes from the first spoke it's important to always skip one hole and then insert the second spoke onto the rim Once you have all your spokes inserted there should be no spokes crossing one another and at this point I will go ahead and flip the wheel over from here I add the remaining spokes to the hub and I just try and place each spoke in between the bottom set of spokes Once you've attached all your spokes and the nipples are screwed on, we can then add the wheel onto the stand. Again, I'm using my wooden stand for this. And from here, I try to very carefully turn every nipple until the last thread of the spoke. So all the nipples are equal. The wheel will still be loose at this point and that's why we will then use our spoke tool and turn every nipple four half turns after the four half turns the wheel should be a bit more stable it can still be a bit loose and that's how we will do them again for the second round another four half turns and then squeeze each spoke just to kind of reset the nipples onto the room Your wheel should be out of alignment due to the squeezing and that's why we just make adjustments and turn the nipples where there was a bit of a deviancy. After you've made your adjustments, you can just check again and the wheel should be running straight.